Good day to you all. Thanks again for joining us for our Five for Faith series. Today I just want to encourage you by considering God's blessings that he has given to us. I think at this time we all need a sense of God's blessing and just the realization that he is doing all of these things all the time. So what is a blessing? Here's a couple definitions for you. It is a special favor, mercy, or benefit. A gift bestowed by God, thereby bringing happiness. The invoking of God's favor upon a person. And in times like these, I just really need to get a sense of God's blessing. So if you're like me, this is a good word to wake up every morning and get a sense that, boy, God is showering blessings on me. And, and then in turn, giving that blessing away to other people. You know, the Bible is littered with stories of folks who have been blessed. You know, I think of Sarai, for instance, who longed for this promised son. And she prayed to God often and years and years of petitioning him and then that dream finally realized and you know it was all about God's timing I wonder if she had given up hope but it was about God's timing and she he, she was blessed by her son Isaac and unexpectedly so the story of Joseph and how he was thrown into slavery by his brothers I wonder if he had lost hope Wondered where God was at times, especially in the dungeon. But ultimately, he realized God's plan in his life and was blessed to not only get out of the dungeon and to see life, but see his, his father and many saved by him becoming second in command and helping people through the famine of that day. But what is it that is, um, do you believe in these blessings even during this trial that we are experiencing. You know, I really believe that God wants us to be blessed, even in tough times. And maybe you're saying, I don't even see that happening right now. I'm, I'm lonely. I've lost my job. You know, times are tough. Um, dreams unfulfilled. How do we get a sense of God's blessings through that? Well, folks, I, I, I believe God wants to shower us with blessings. I really do as his kids. And not in a way like a televangelist would, would do, you know, like touch the screen and the blessings will come flowing from the screen. Not that kind of a way. But I believe that God intends to show those kids who are his, his blessings. Listen to what the Apostle Paul shares about this thought. 2 Corinthians 9.8, I want to encourage you to look at a couple of these verses I share at your own time. God is able to make every blessing of yours overflow for you, so that in every situation, you will always have all you need for any good work. You know, sometimes we need to get up in our daily routine and... Pray with perspective. Our youth directors, Annie and Melissa, shared a simple verse that we all know with uh, students yesterday, and I wanted to pass this on to you for encouragement. Psalm 118, verse 24. This is the day that the Lord has made. Let's rejoice and be glad in it. Man, I just like the simpleness of that verse. You know, for you that like country music, uh, there's a song out, Blessings by Florida Georgia Line, just sharing the simpleness of the blessings. And sometimes they come up and you don't even know they're, they're there. Lastly, the writer of Lamentations, a book written solely for grief and sorrow. And right in the middle of the book, he shares God's blessings with the folks. Listen to this. He says, Because 
of the Lord's great love, we are not consumed for his compassions. They never fail. They are new every morning. Great is your faithfulness. The Lord is good to those whose hope is in him, to the ones who seek him. That being his kids. Folks, he wrote this in the midst of the total collapse of the holy city of Jerusalem. God's people being killed and the rest of them being dragged away into exile. He wrote of the blessings that are still there. Folks, we are so blessed. Let's all stop and be reminded of the many blessings that are all around us. Be prepared to get showered upon by God's blessings every day, and in turn, share those blessings with others. God bless you as you walk through this with him on a daily basis. Share it with others, will you? Thanks for listening.